anyway, um, weather? Well, it's not quite as uh, not quite as sunny as it was yesterday. It's beautiful yesterday, wasn't it? Lots of sunshine around rain for a few though, and there will be more wet weather around today. So we've got sunny spells again for many of us, but, uh, but also some heavy thundery downpours, particularly towards the south, spells of rain further north. And it's been quite a soggy start to the day as well. <laughs> good morning again, good morning to you at home as well. It was a beautiful sunrise earlier on this morning in Northern Scotland. It was really rather soggy though for many of us further south. And there's been a lot of cloud around as well. Of course, a wet night for many, the ground already pretty saturated once again in many spots such as here in Kent, but actually across northern Scotland and across the southeast of England will be some of the driest weather, I think, as we head through the rest of the day. It's exactly. Feed the birds. Um, <laughs> just looking at the picture next to you, Elizabeth, I'm not sure you want to feed that. It's coming in no. and chips. <laughs> <laughs> yes, magic of television. It, I think it looks bigger on TV than it actually is in real life. If I stand here, it will look like it's flying over my head, I guess. <laughs> Watch out. <laughs> well, exactly. It's not a pigeon, it's a seagull, isn't it? And that's because we are in St Leonard's on Sea for this picture. And you can see, importantly, the skies are starting to brighten up behind all of this cloud. It's been such a wet night, hasn't it? Um, and I think, Elizabeth, it's possibly not gliding weather for in many places today. <laughs> Uh, yeah, possibly not. I have to confess, I don't know very much about the sport of gliding, but I wouldn't want to be gliding anywhere near these shower clouds um, for the rest of the day today because some of these showers looking pretty impressive, I have to say. Uh, this one already developed in Big Bree on sea. We've got some brighter skies, though. Thank goodness it's been a very wet night. Of course, all of that rain just gradually spreading further northwards. It stays quite unsettled as we head through uh, much of the week as well with high pressure building in from the west as we head it towards next weekend. So in general, to sum up, we've got showers at times next week, average temperatures, and possibly something a bit warmer and drier for next weekend. Roger. And yeah, that's good news, Elizabeth. Thank you very much, particularly for parents out there trying to occupy their children over half term. <laughs> so things will get a little bit better. That's encouraging.